In this lesson, we're going to learn how we can handle React Native image, and how to handle images in React Native. That's a new app. Let's create a functional component. Import React from React. Import view and text from React Native export default function app and let's return a view and inside this view let's return a text called hello look hello is here but it's it's at the top at the left here because in ios there is no save area view so let's center it just give this view some styling style felix of one felix to, to fill all the screen and justify content center and align our items to center as well. Look, our text has been centered. Don't worry if you if you are not understand what I have just typed, because we're gonna describe all of this later. We're gonna describe the the, the text, the view, and those styling. But today we're gonna talk about images. So first of all, let's download that that assets file that I provided in this video, we have here three images and add them inside uh, inside your app. Let's create a, fo a folder called src and add uh, inside it folder called images, images and add those three images to that, to that folder. Okay, those are the images that we're gonna uh, import inside uh, inside our app right now. Okay, let's import image number one. To use image in React Native, we just type image and import it from React Native. If you notice, I have here auto importing. When we when I when I'm type a component, it will be automatically imported at the top. So. Uh, you have to make sure that you imported the image component from React Native. Let's give it his source. Source take a, a require function. That is the source of the image. What, where is our images? Images inside a folder called src. And inside this folder, there is another folder called images. So src will require dot, that mean the same path we here in the app the tsx and the src is the the same path so so we have just to add uh, one dot here to to tell the compiler that we we are in the same path the app the tsx and image now uh, src inside src folder called images let's open it Inside this images folder, there are, uh, let's start with our first image, food.png. Look, we have imported our image, but now let's give our images, our, the, our image some styling. Okay, uh, let's give it some styling. First of all, we want to, to, handle his height and width let's give it a height of for example 100 and width of 100 pixels look but i think uh, if you notice the image has been cut so we have here a resize mode property we can make it a center to be at the center of the screen we can make it contain it's, it's like the center, the view contain it. We can make it cover, cover, it will cover 
the whole view, I mean the 100 and 100 pixels, but it will be cut too. We can, we can make it uh, repeat, look, if we make it repeat, it will repeat itself to fill the 100, 100 dimensions. We can make it stretch, stretch to, it will stretch its, itself, okay? Let's make it center. Okay, let's give her a border, border width of four, for example. We can change his pole, his border, border color, with using this property, border color. Let's make it red. Look, if we change it, his border color, we can give her a border radius of ten. Look. And here's Android, Android 2. Uh, we can, uh, let's use the another image. Let's try with another image. Let's import our image component and give him the source. So the source will be required. We're gonna open SRC file, SRC. In, inside SRC folder, we have images folder. And inside images folder, we have here um, a image called user.png. This image, user.png. Wow! <laughs> let's give him. Let's give it some styling. Let's copy those styling. Oh. <laughs> And let's make her size mode as a center. It's been. Let's give her some margin. I want to add space from this image to the top. So I have I I have to give her margin top of twenty, for example, to to have this uh, to have a space between those two images. Let's make his size mode a contain a contain. Uh, we have here uh, a property. I want to change the color of this icon. Uh, it's black. I want to make it red. So we have a, uh, a style property called tint color. Let's make it, for example, red. Look, the, the image has been red. We can make it blue. We can make it orange. As we see, as we want. Uh, now let's uh, try the, the last one. I want you to pause the video and try it. I want you to render this image, this image here, uh, down here. I want to render it. Now, I hope you could do this uh, small task. We will add the image and we'll give it the source and it will be required. Let's open SRC folder inside images folder called Sawi dot Here's a, a track. The, the image here is BNG and BNG is extension. That's the user and food. User and food. But so here, so images here, it's a JPEG. So we shouldn't type BNG, but we should type JPEG. Okay, let's give him, let's give it some styling. Let's give it uh, the style. Uh, height and width of 100. Let's give it a margin button, margin top. And let's give it border radius. If, if, what if you want to make an image round? Just give her the, the border radius of um, the half of the height and width. For example, that's 100. The half equals to 50. So we just add a border radius of 50. Look, it's been like a, like a circle. Uh, that's, that's for today. Don't worry if you not understand something like justify content and align items. We're going to describe this in the, another videos when we describe the view. And we're going to also describe the text components. We, we're going to describe all the the react native components and how to build amazing screens using ui uh, using the react native components so please don't forget to subscribe and 
and build the and hit the bell button and don't forget also the like button and thanks for watching